If you want to see how I made this 30 by 40 blanket, stay tuned. Okay, so before we get all the way started, if you have not, which I know you have not, uh, please subscribe to my channel and just show me love and support. Uh, just if you want to be a part of my gang, a part of my crew, if you want to be inspired, if you want to learn anything new, if you want to teach me something that I don't know, um, just please subscribe. And I'm looking forward to your comments, your interaction, and if you love the creations that I'm making. <music> Okay, so right now I'm just designing and procreate. When I'm done there, I'm gonna take it to Photoshop to finish. Um, I was I had other intentions, but the file that I bought from Etsy did not work out for me, so I had to go with something different. Just checking to make sure it's recording. Um, so that I can show you guys, oh shoot, so I can show you guys how I actually do the cutting um, on this blanket. So I'll start with the cut tool and I have a 24 inch printer so I want to make sure, I don't want it directly in the center, I don't want to line because you can see even though the whole image I don't have any problem with uh, the image not transferring or not being in, in line, I do have a problem with splitting it down the center. That's just that's something I just don't, I prefer not to do. So I'll go over to the side and I'm just gonna guess. See, this is in the middle. All right, okay, so this would be about, so we're probably 22 and a half. So first we're gonna, do this cut because I've already saved this I'm just going to demonstrate I'm not going to save it and I'm not going to print it over I'll still show you how I um, set up my printer and I have a 24 inch Epson um, F what is it F570 the sublimation printer. So I'll go here and I'll go file and I'll go um, export save for web legacy. So when I click that it's gonna do what it does and just wait on the picture to get here wait on, the, on it to finish loading. Um, I never zoom out to check but it's gonna be very very zoomed in on the picture. So if you want to zoom out, you can. If you don't, then don't. My computer is very, very, very slow. Um, it needs to be cleaned out. It is, I'm sick of it, if that counts. But, so I guess I'll zoom out because I've never zoomed out before. Oh, there it is. And it shows you what two pieces that it's going to save. But because I don't want to mess up and have like a gap or have an issue. I'm going to, we're going to cancel that. We don't want to say that. I am going to go over here and slice on this side too and save that. So when I save this, I'm going to be like, I want to grab this left side. So I'm going to save it my first Easter Mario left side. That's how I save that. Now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to go to view, I'm going to clear the slices. Just remember that we did it like on 22 and a half. So I'm going to clear. So now I'm going to go to 20, that'll give me a two inch overlap, which is excessive, but it's safe. <laughs> so then I do that. And that will slice it for this side. All right. So now I am going to go here and it's going to be the same thing. Save, I'm not safe, export, uh, save for web legacy. 
So since I've already done that, I have the pieces here, but I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna bring the pieces in again to show you how place embedded. Okay, we're gonna open the right. And then I'm going to move it all the way to the right. Okay. So now I'm going to um, click on that because I want this one to go under. So place embedded. And I'm going to grab the left. So we're going to move this over here. But you can see that I line up perfectly. If I go right here and I turn down the opacity. Okay. So turn that down. Turn this up as it is. You can see. You can see there. That's the overlap. You can you can see that there is where it's going to overlap. We turn them all back up. And of course, turn off one of them and then um, the print. Okay, so we have it all printed out, all taped together. I'm trying not to burn myself on my heat press. Taped together and ready to be put on the blanket. So, I'm just gonna get my blanket together and put it on this heat press here. So, let's come on up. There's my heat press. It's a little dark over there. Let's see if I can get some light over there. Roll off all the lint that I can.
if you like this video, please do not forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.